guys and welcome back to another video today i'm just gonna be talking with you guys about any and everything so um i'm actually supposed to be at work today but girl <laughs> i had this altercation with a worker or whatever no we had this meeting at work and I work with a lot of females. Y'all know I work in housekeeping, so I clean rooms or whatever. And I've been doing this for almost three years, which is something that I feel like I like, but it's not somewhere I want to be for the rest of my life. But, you know, it's chill. You know, we clean up our rooms. We can be on our phone. I feel like it's something that I'm comfortable doing for right now. So I'm so sick right now. But let me get off this story. <sighs> so sick. I just had to blow my nose. But, um... So I figured that being at work or whatever, working with women, that it would be better, of course. And this is not my first housekeeping job. This is my third. I've moved around. I had problems with the last management, manager, supervisor, whatever. And for one, this little ass mirror. So I can't tell if they're even or not, but whatever. <laughs> I figured the situation would be better, working with women. I'm going, to, I'm going to skip through this because I'm never going to get this out because I keep stopping to do these brows. I keep looking down at this shit and whatever. I got rolled up today and they sent me home for work because I got into it with this other co-worker that has been that has been um bothering me. She was spreading around the um job place that the maintenance guy and I had something going on which my way when, I, when stuff like this is brought to me in a workplace I don't want to ever want to ruin it for myself. So, you know, and my way of helping the situation was to, like, just not talk to her, like, just not fuck with her no So, a situation came up where we had to work together, and I made it clear that I didn't like her. And ever since then, she's been nitpicking. And, of course, she doesn't know why, but, you know, I told my supervisor why I don't like her or whatever. And I get, they talked to her, and it made the situation worse. So, now... She's still nitpicking, but she's, like, I'm a new person coming in, so now not only is she nitpicking, but it's everybody else, too, also. And I'm not going to go for that. Like, bitch, I will fight you. But, um, so, it's got to this point. We had a meeting or whatever, and we talked about um having disagreements with everybody. Like, she was just messing with me in the meeting. It was, like, just a whole bunch of bullshit, like... And I don't go for bullshit. Like, I don't give a fuck about that shit. Like, I don't even give a fuck about no motherfucking job. But they like that. Like, like, hold on, play with me. But, um. It was just a lot of mess. Like, just a lot of fucking mess. And I want the, like. But. I had a situation at work. I was at work or whatever. And me and a coworker were talking. And I was telling her. I was like, um. I don't plan on being here too much longer. Like, I just got fed up with it. And I hate that I talked to her about it because, or any, I hate that I even talked, like, about it. But I was like, I'm just fed up with this. Like, I'm finna, I'm looking for me a new job. And when I leave, I'm gonna fight this bitch. So, whatever. And moral of the story is, um, my supervisor was listening on the low. And, um, I get to work and they call me in the office. They send me home. They said they're gonna call me and say that I threatened someone, which I've been in this situation before. They might fire me. If they fire me, I'm being her ass, like period. I'm being her ass, period. I'm fighting the bitch. I don't give a fuck if they call the police. I don't have to, you know, whenever you ask your parents for stuff, you have to, there's always something that comes with it. I like to make my own money. I've been doing this since I was 16. I want to keep this shit going, so, you know, and I definitely don't want to go back home because, as you know, I'm staying in Memphis with my gay father, and I'm definitely not going to depend on him for anything, like, I'm grown, no ma'am, and I'm texting off my iPad, so, I got sent home from work, so, I'm at home, and I'm bored, <laughs> so, and I keep saying so, but, you know, my boss said that he's going to call me later today and let me know what's going on, so, um, 
Yeah, I've been through a situation like this before and I got fired. So I'm gonna let you know the outcome. If I get fired, I might as well beat this bitch ass. Like I have nothing else. I have, you know. <laughs> but what ifs? So in other news or whatever, I've been trying my hardest. Like I've been making the decision to so I'm an Instagram over like if, if you just have watched my Instagram over the years, I've always deleted pictures because I never feel like they're up to par. And guys, I really, 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 really want to be a model, like, so, so badly. And I feel like I can do it because I just feel like I can do it. Like, I really feel like I can do it. I've taken some good pictures this year, but I still feel like I want to start over. So, um... And I, I take pride in my pictures. Like, honestly, I really, really do. Like, I take my time with my photos and, you know, with everything that I, with anything that I do, I take my time. This picture either, like, I want all my pictures to be, like, good shots. Like, this, this dressing up, like, style stuff, I don't feel like this is enough, especially not with the border. In it. It's just, I just, I don't know. I look into it, like, way deeper. Like, this. This is when it's, this is not when it started, but this is like, this is worthy enough. And I like this. I like this, not the background because I'm in like a parking lot, but these pictures right here, like I took, I literally, like how I am now, it's 1130, but I wake up earlier. I wake up early and I do my makeup and I go outside and I take pictures. That's when I got these pictures, which are, this one is one of my favorite pictures. But I'm not taking pictures of that. This is not worthy enough. I don't like this. I like the picture. The picture is cute, but it's not. I want my Instagram to be composed of... I want my Instagram to be like a portfolio for like modeling agencies. I said I want to be a makeup artist, but there are already a lot of makeup artists. And um, I feel like I still can't do it, but I want to make... I want to make modeling my first prior, priority. Because I take... I have a deep passion for... um photography and modeling like and makeup plays a big part in it my pictures where i'm being a thought or either i'm dressed like heavily dressed as a trade will get the most likes i do take my social media like very very my not social media but well yeah kind of kind of seriously but you know i do slip up every now and then and post you know like their straps i try not to or whatever but you know it happens or whatnot but like i would get emails about like modeling or whatever and like attending stuff but it's always so far and i work guys like i work you know and i understand now that i will never get anywhere if i don't take this step this is gonna be so well I, I don't have a mirror or anything i never do them because they're so like far away and i just like the way my life is set up i just can't be like, but guys, I finished up my little one to my little face. Y'all get so y'all got to see a little of the process, but I had to do the rest off camera because the inspection guy came in for this house. So, I don't know, just did this case, but um, <coughs> or whatever. Literally, get on YouTube, and the first thing I see in my recommended James Charles exposes Tati after she deletes the by sister video and made millions. Charles, oh wow. I don't wear how like, but um, I'm gonna call home my boyfriend. I'm gonna put her. Hello. 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 Why are you playing that audio? Because I'm doing something on my phone. So I called you from the iPad. Uh, why are you playing that? Because I got makeup on. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Are you trying to? Because I want to see it. No, I don't want to see it. No, because I really like if we was looking at the phone, I would do it. But I'm on the iPad, and I don't want the resolution to make it look like I'm ugly, even though I look good. But we can try. Oh no, he no. Nope. See, I almost, I almost FaceTimed you, but then I looked at the resolution on this iPad, and it's horrible. And I don't want to look horrible, so. Oh, okay. I see. I understand. I 
Yeah. But I got another interview. Oh, really? Do you? It's tomorrow. Where is it? I'm just kidding. You lay down. Just call me back when you get off. I was watching YouTube. Oh, okay. I'm about to lunch in about 30 minutes. I might not get out till late. That's why I was trying to talk to you and hear your voice. Hear my voice. Yeah, hear your voice. You know, I'm being a good guy. You be what? Being a good guy. I'm a good guy. All right. Well, you be a good guy because. I just thought about oh, you saying you don't like me in makeup. Yeah, you do. I mean, it's okay. Just, uh, I just talked to you uh, later. Because you be, you know, you catch me back. I do be catch me back. I don't. You know, you catch me back. Shut your ass up. Yes, I do. I'm just trying to play up. Well, I'm not going to touch you up. But, uh, Alright. I guess I, I guess I just, how are you guys? Text me. <laughs> <laughs> but, bitch. Damn, what was I talking about? So, thank you guys for watching this video. I'm gonna edit this and get it up today. Or whatever he texts me. Am I being air short or do I just like being on the phone with you? <laughs> he texts me. I didn't want to rush him off the phone, yeah, but I wanted to finish recording this video. Yeah. So, this concludes this video. You guys, please subscribe. And I'm going to keep these videos coming. And go follow me on my Instagram or whatever. It'll probably be... I'm going to put it up here. I want to put it up there. Go follow me on my fucking Instagram. Go follow me on fucking Twitter. Go add me on Facebook, bitch. Because I'm the baddest hoe out here, period. Like, and I want you guys to grow with me. Like, period. Bye-bye, guys. <laughs> Somewhere in the house.